An airline passenger is accused of trying to open a cockpit door in mid-flight and then hitting a flight attendant in the face, not once, but twice. Tonight, we're learning how much that passenger may be fined. More than $52,000. Now, the I team first told you about the rise of unruly passengers. And tonight, our investigative reporter, Lolita Lopez, shows us what can happen if you don't follow the rules. This is video of a man being held down by other passengers on a flight in March when it appears that traveler tried to open an emergency exit door mid flight. The plane was making its way to Los Angeles and had to be diverted to Denver. This video appears to show the passenger on a gurney being wheeled out and taken into custody. If we don't stand up, it's only going to get worse. This is a woman yelling at passengers on another flight after refusing to wear a mask, which is required on public transportation. What we've seen on our planes is flight attendants being physically assaulted, pushed, choked. Uh, we had a passenger urinate. We had a passenger spit into the mouth of a child. The I team first told you about the increase in cases of unruly and at times aggressive passengers flight attendants have been experiencing over the past few months. The Federal Aviation Administration is now dealing with 1,300 complaints in just four months' time, compared to 150 for a typical year, many of them about passengers refusing to wear a mask. According to records obtained by the I-Team and our NBC Bay Area partners, five major California airports alone have responded to more than 150 separate complaints for ignoring safety COVID rules since last fall. The physical and verbal abuse that flight attendants have been taking has been way off the charts. You disrupt a flight with threatening, intimidating, or violent behavior, you'll face a civil penalty from the FAA of up to $35,000 and possible imprisonment as well. On Monday, the FAA announced four more proposed fines for flights taken from last December to February. One man on a flight from Hawaii to Seattle was fined $52,500 for allegedly trying to open a cockpit door while in the air, repeatedly refusing to comply with flight crew instructions and hitting a flight attendant in the face twice. The FAA says police boarded the plane when it landed and took the man into custody. Two more fines against passengers allege they would not comply when asked to wear masks. In one incident, a man allegedly refused to put away alcohol he had brought on the plane and continually removed his face mask or wore it improperly. He faces an $18,500 fine. And also in February, investigators say a woman refused to comply with flight attendants' repeated requests to wear a mask. She allegedly started yelling and cursing at crew members. She now faces a $9,000 dollar fine. Remember, while some things are opening up, the mass mandates on planes, trains, and buses stay in effect through mid-September. All the airlines we contacted say they will continue to enforce the rules. The FAA says passengers have 30 days after receiving an FAA enforcement letter to respond to the agency. They will continue to push a zero-tolerance policy for any abusive, threatening, or intimidating behavior. For the I-Team, Lolita Lopez, NBC4 News.